at uh, Newcastle. And here we go, the first time we've seen these teams in the 2021 it's Rugby League it's World it's Cup. Scotland, Scotland in the darker blue, Italy, Italy in the paler blue. Not the kick clash that you might think it is. The referee has signed this off after a slight mix-up with the Scotland kit, but all good to go. Scotland led with the Saltire flag. And with the Hooter signalling in the background, we are ready to get this Group B encounter started. It's Italy against Scotland. It's a 2021 Rugby League World Cup, and Scotland get first touch of the ball, looking to settle things. Again, we've got Parata, Brown again, Brown already. Oh, a big hit coming in there from Sam Luckley. What a tackle that was coming in. Yeah, Luckley read that like a book, and there's a bit of push and shoving going on. And it's Parata again, going on the short side, offloading back towards the centre is Brian King. A big hit again coming in, though, from Scotland. Luckily, once again involved there. Parata assessing his options. Ball comes out to Iaria, keeping it moving to Robinson with a chip through. Chased as well. Will it be not clear? Will it be touched by the Italians? The referee raises a hand, goes to the video, and the Italians, they've scored. And we get there with the try from the fullback, Luca Polselli, winning the race. Here's Parata. To the centre of the field, drive coming forward. And Italy really now pushing that line. Here comes a chance. And it looks like Italy have got their second of the game through Dean Parata, the hooker. And Italy are in. They've scored again. Will it be a third try of the afternoon for the Italians? It's with Brown. He keeps it moving. Campagnola, what a ball! Oh! Oh, oh no, it was outstanding play from Brown and Campagnolo to set the Italians up over on that left-hand side. That went out there to Lynette, but kept alive to Garn. Garn goes now, slid right to the middle of the field. What a tackle coming in from Paul Selly. Garn looked like he had space opening up in front of him, but Scotland now with that momentum. Can they make it crack before half-time? Ball goes out wide. Is there a gap there for Scotland? Oh. It comes loose. And that, again, a chance going begging for Scotland. How many times does it feel like we've said that in this first half? That's Hodge. Campagnolo then. Out wide to Atkinson. Is the space here for the Italians going for the corner? It looks like it could be Mason that's in. The celebrations have started from the Italians. And it's a try. Jake Mason on his debut it's for right. Italy oh, has got them off to the best possible start Jake in the second Mason. half. Instead of kicking long, chasing hard. As a break comes through from the Italians, this scoreboard could still be ticking over. It's Atkinson. Atkinson chased by Briley. What a tackle from the fullback from Scotland. A definite try saver there. Brown back to Campagnolo. Campagnolo along the line finds Atkinson. Will he be successful this time? He goes for the line. Held just short by Scotland. This is the last, the last for Scotland to defend. And there again, little ball to Mason. Two from two on his debut as well. There we go, two tries in this half, both coming from the winger Jake Mason and Italy from this particular set, and this is the last for them. Bailey Haywood, what can they do with it? Kick goes over the top into space, it's so, oh! Is that a try? Has Haywood followed that up? No, the referee right on the spot for it. I think Haywood thought he was in with a chance, and I think certainly the crowd went with it as well, but in the end, it's just the handover. The commentator's case yeah. strikes again. <laughs> There's Bell. Oh, great ball to Luckley. Luckley goes up the centre of the field. If he wasn't a prop forward, I think he'd have his chances fancied. But keeping the ball alive to Briley with the kick over the top. Can Briley get it away? He can't. The defence does it. Great. I think a penny for Nathan Graham's thoughts at this point. As, oh, here we go again with Mason. He's on for his hat trick. See ya. Going right down the field. Nobody's going to catch Mason. And he gets his third try of this half, the third try of the game. A hat-trick on his debut for Italy. What a way to make your international debut with a hat-trick of tries. This is sensational stuff. We talk and in half, little ball to Lynette. Lynette tries to stretch his way out. He's tall, but he's not that tall. Still a bit of daylight between him and that whitewash. Here goes Hood. Hood scrambles his way back, eventually gets the ball to Bell. 
who shows it, loses a bit of ground before offloading to Aitken. Aitken goes, running at the angle, great ball there to Wormsley. Wormsley's in, and finally Scotland get themselves on the scoreboard. Lachlan Wormsley, the winger, gets the try for Scotland. Yeah, finally the Scots break the duck. It's a beautiful ball from Aitken. Too little, too late though for the Scots. Going to determine who plays quarter-final World Cup Rugby League. Well, both coaches said this afternoon was a must-win, and it's the Italians that have come up with that win, give themselves a good chance of trying to progress from this Group B with this win this afternoon against Scotland. They have dominated the Scottish. It's shown on the scoreboard with that 28 points to 4 victory from Italy.